Hey there, Jamie Smith. Uh, just wanted to uh, throw a quick video together. I've noticed a lot of people sharing their funnels on the uh, ClickFunnels uh, Facebook group, and most of those funnels have their default title set to My Awesome Landing Page, which is uh, what the title is of the page is set to whenever you create a new funnel. Um, I just uh, I think that everybody would be served well if we just ch make sure, and the first thing you do is change that title to something a little bit more meaningful, because what happens is Facebook, if you insert the link to that funnel, Facebook picks that up and then they're going to put in whatever the title of the page is which is probably not what you want it to say uh, when you post it to Facebook so uh, it's since everybody seems to be having a problem with it I just wanted to step through real quick exactly how to do that I know it's probably covered in the tutorial videos but I want to throw it up here just so it's uh, quick and easy uh, for everybody to see so I'm actually in my ClickFunnels account now I'm just going to jump into one of my um, one of my funnels I've got one here uh, test membership just set up so I'm going to go in and I'm going to click um, edit funnel and I'm going to jump into that one and uh, take just a second to load up so I've got my membership access page I'm just going to do a quick open in the editor here and uh, we'll jump in here uh, it's coming up it's coming up you'll notice that at the top it still says my awesome landing page that's because I haven't actually changed this one so the default title is going to say my awesome landing page dash powered by clickfunnels.com okay and that's great but it's not going to do you much good when you go and post this out uh, on Facebook um, or uh, Google picks up your link or something like that that's the top that's going to be what shows as the link and, and that's probably not what you want uh, so the first thing to do is just head over to settings uh, when you land in there and go to meta tags shows social settings and then just go into page title select that out and put in um, you know something like um, you know test membership access something like that I usually take out the page description as well unless you want to have something in there you can also um, so you can put in your own page description and your keywords if you want to by default out of the box I think uh, that a lot of pages uh, ClickFunnels even put in a, a just a basic generic page description which you probably don't want I always put in my page author because that sometimes get gets picked up by the social media sites as well and then if you wanted to have uh, a social image of what that page is which you can do by uh, grabbing a video uh, or, or grabbing a snapshot of what you want that page uh, to, to be so if you're on Facebook and you see um, in fact let me just pull up uh, Facebook here I'm gonna go into my Facebook and I'm gonna go to, uh, over to the ClickFunnels group uh, or I'm sorry the dot-com secrets group and um, I made a post earlier this morning and I'll actually show you what I uh, threw up so you can see what image picked up so you can see here it's got this seven secrets to internet marketing failure uh, that's the image that's set for that social image that's what's pulling in here um, uh, to that page so the way you set that is you go in here and click on page image URL and then you can actually click um, the image that you want to use. I uh, notice my uh, I have a pre sale image for one of my internet marketing or well, for one of my fitness products. Uh, but you can click the image that you want to use from your images, or you can use a stock image if you wanted to. Um, you know, you can go and, and do the icon finder, whatever you want. Uh, just grab one, you highlight it, and you click add image, and it's going to throw that up. And you'll notice the page image URL changes, and then just click save and exit and you're done and now uh, when you uh, go to that page so now if we open that page up uh, we can see here that uh, well now it's actually throw me straight in there because I'm already registered uh, but it will actually change that page um, and so if we do a open an editor again we should see that it pulls up so there we got our page title now is set to test membership access and that's what we want and then whenever you post it to Facebook or Google or anything like that it's going to pull in that proper page so hopefully this is helpful um, hopefully it's useful and I uh, hope everyone has a great day and just uh, best of luck with your success with ClickFunnels